What up, YouTube? We're back. Uh, real quick, guys. First, I just want to thank you all for the... Honestly, for keeping it real on the last video. You know, I appreciate all the comments, good and bad, the dislikes. Even back in the cat video, I think it was about three weeks ago. Let's keep it real. Let's keep it raw. And honestly, don't hold back. I just... I don't want to have this pussy putting around page. You know, let's just keep it real. Moving on. This video. I'm dedicating this video to you ladies, okay? This one is for you girls. This is about growing a big butt and great hamstrings. So we're gonna call this the Big Booty Judy video. Like it. All right, let's get into it. The golden rule, heels all day. Heels all day. Simple, three words. I just want you to engrave that into your mind. Heels all day. Because the three things I'm gonna talk about after this, piggyback off of that. That is the golden rule. That will be tacked on to the three things that we are talking about fixing. Number one, not going down to 90 degrees, curls. Uh, and guys, too, I mean, I know you guys are gonna watch this video, too. If you don't go all the way down, I'm not talking about breaking parallel, I'm talking about just going to 90 degrees. I'm, you know, here, okay, just here, heels all day, but going to 90 degrees. And this is the issue with not going all the way down. Yeah, I might got a booger in my nose. <laughs> this is the issue with not going all the way down. You are not allowing yourself or actually inhibiting yourself from engaging your, your hamstrings and your glutes. Yeah, they're firing a little, but they're not actually getting a full contraction. You're putting predominantly all the weight, all the load on your quads. And since, we're, since the golden rule is heels all day, and you're like this, okay, and you come down here, most likely you drifted to your toes, okay? Which, look at, puts it in your quads not back here this is actually very soft right now okay now let's say we go heels let's <laughs> let's say we go heels all day and go 90 degrees okay so we're heels all day like this we're going down to 90 degrees pulling my toes up so I'm here all right and when I'm at this position your quads actually aren't your strongest point. You're gonna need to recruit your glutes and your hamstrings that come up. Push your knees out and use your butt. Like that, okay? That is the issue. Man, I really think there's something in my nose. That is the issue with not going 90 degrees, ladies, is you're actually taking away from the area that you're trying to grow. And honestly, if you don't go 90 degrees, I'm really sorry about that, burping. If you don't go 90 degrees, you're pretty much not gonna grow a big butt. That is the honest truth right there. Moving on to number two, the butt wing, the arch. Having your, the natural S in your lower back round. I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about. I'm coming down, I'm coming down. My arch is there, my arch is still there. And then, oh, there, okay. Literally, you can almost see my legs stop contracting. Boom. What happened was we just transferred all that weight, all that energy right to our lower backs. So, all that work, all that loading that you were doing to your hamstrings and your glutes just pretty much got negated. You just said, ah, I'm not gonna have it there anymore. I'm just gonna shift it to my back. Literally what happens. So girls, it is really, really important when you ladies are trying to grow those hamstrings and that booty, do not allow yourself to butt wing. Number three, ladies, doing the same movement over and over again, doing the same stance over and over again. It's it's counterproductive. You are trying to grow a well-rounded butt. You're trying to, you know, you're actually trying to figure out where your weak point is, where your weak, the, the, the weak link in the chain is. But if you continue to do the same stance, let's, I'm gonna demo this one. If you don't vary your stance, you're only gonna be using the same muscles continuously. And you have to remember, if you're lacking in a specific region, say your hamstrings, you have muscles that tend to fire and tend to take over early, okay? So you need to put yourself in a position pretty much of being uncomfortable, being in a lot of ways unstable. So what I would do is I would come out here. Now I definitely don't squat out here a lot. I already feel unstable. I already feel like I'm having to recruit my inner and outer thighs. I'm already having to load my hamstrings early because this is awkward. There we go. Down. And then drive out. So right away. Nice. So many different muscles firing. I felt my inner thighs right away. 
versus my normal narrow stance. So where I'm getting at is doing the same stance over and over again when it comes to developing a muscle is wrong, okay? Your body's very smart, it's gonna adapt. When you become proficient at something, whether it be cardio, squatting, anything in the gym, that's actually a bad thing. Now, that might sound weird, but when it comes to the gym nutrition in your body, you wanna be a Ferrari. You wanna be inefficient. You don't wanna be a Prius. You come in here, do 100 squats and don't grow. What do you want? You're a Prius. Congratulations, you're a Prius. It's about growing. Muscles get bigger and smaller. And you guys can piddle around with freaking plates under your heels and toes and stuff all day. But if you squat correctly, if you can learn how to distribute the weight to your heels, you don't need any of that. I don't know this fucking song, this song, man. It's hard to freaking think when this song is. Just bob to this one and go for it. All right. Anyways, that's all I got to say about it, ladies. Honestly, try those tips. Let me know how it goes. If you guys enjoyed this video, if you guys dig the tips, all right, I will. What are you going to do, bro? <laughs> I'm going to make another video. If you guys dig this video, I'll go into all the shit about squats, all the things we're doing wrong from knees dipping in, knees dipping out, box squats, chains. I mean, I'll go into depth. Let me know. Comment below.